what's up guys this is furious warrior 11 and we're back again with game maker tutorial how to make a fan space fan game this time part two okay so we left off making the night screen as you might have remembered you know we put in the static and the night flash you know I'm gonna give you a little overview of what we did if you haven't seen the first part go into my videos and click on it so you'll get caught up with whatever we're doing Okay, so in this episode, we well in this part, we will be making the office and the doors with the lights and the doors. Okay, so if I click like new game, it goes to the newspaper. Then I'll wait some time. Just waiting. And then, you know, it goes right here. Then that's where it stops. So right now we're going to continue from that. Okay, so, <clears throat> sorry. All right, so what you wanna do now is you wanna make a background and call it BCK Office. You can go ahead and edit the background and make it the size, 1280 by 720. Once you've got that, just decorate your office. I'll decorate mines this way. I'll see you guys when I'm done. Alright guys, now that I got my office ready. Oh wait, I think I gotta make the doors. Hold on. No way, I don't. Yeah, I don't need to. Alright, now that I got my office ready, you can click check. Oh wait, hold on. You're gonna wanna select the part where you want your fan. So let's click copy. All right, we got that. Now you're gonna wanna make a sprite. I already made a folder called game. If you wanna know how to make a folder, you just click on sprites or any other thing and click create group and then just name it. All right, so we gotta make a fan. This will be animated. All right, so you wanna paste it. No, wait, not, not that. Uh, Paste it, then do that, all right. Now, I'll see you when my fan is done. Alright, now that I got my fan, you're not going to want to fill in the fan part. You're going to want to get... Alright, you're going to want to have it like that. You're going to want to copy and paste. You're going to want to have it like that. Okay? You're going to want to... Oh wait, yeah, you keep it like that. Alright, on the first one, you're going to want to make it like this. No, wait. Like this. Okay. Then on the next one, you're going to want to make it diagonally. Like that. And then you're going to want to click on the first one, copy it, and paste it five times. One, two, three, four, five. Same thing with the other one. Copy. Paste five times. One, two, three, four, five. Then let's see the preview and let's see how it looks. Now that might be a little slow, so let me cut it out a little bit. Couple like two times. One, two. One, two. Okay, let's see that again. Now that looks alright. So let's click check and okay. Alright, now that we got that, we can click on game and make the fan object you're gonna wanna yeah keep it at depth of zero um select the sprite all right we got that now you're gonna want to go oh yeah you're gonna make a, another room you're gonna call it rm office now just for the sake of the of the tutorial it's only gonna be one night you can probably figure out the other nights yourselves I'll give you some other tips in the next parts. All right, I got my office, and once now that I have that, I'm gonna want to select the background of office, right there. All right, then we're gonna want to go to objects and put in the fan. Let's set it somewhere where you want it, like the table. Now, we're gonna want to make a timer for the night one screen, so click on it. All right, don't worry about that. Alright, you're gonna wanna go to pretty sure timing. 
Alright, you're gonna wanna make it 30 steps. Alright, then just click OK. And then you're gonna wanna set the variable um night one screen to about mm, seven seconds. Alright, then you're gonna wanna make an alarm zero event. I'm sorry if I make this wrong because I haven't made a game in a long time. Alright, you're gonna wanna do 30. Then you're gonna wanna put um let's see. Oh wait. You put that over, I'm pretty sure. Darn it. Oh gosh. Yeah, there we go. Alright, net relative. Put negative one. Then night one screen. Oh god. Screen. Okay, and then put if night one screen. And then you just click OK. Again, I want to put that it will go to the next room. So let's find that. Put it in the middle. Alright, there we go. Now we click OK. Let's see if this works. Alright, gotta wait until it compiles. Alright, so we're gonna want to click new game. The Dorito has escaped jail and is killing everyone. We need a night guard at a police station. $1,000 a week. Sounds cool. Okay, then it goes here. Now we wait seven seconds. Yeah, and then it takes you to the office pretty cool alright um I think I'm gonna change the fan color so it won't mix in with like the outlines of the actual thing so I'm gonna probably turn it like into this kind of color yeah that's fine alright let me just do it to every single one there we go okay now let's see what do we need all right um you're gonna want to select the background of the office you're gonna want to select this whole part right here because we're gonna make the door all right let's see like something like that would be okay yeah it's pretty good all right so you're gonna want to go ahead and make a sprite call it s darkness Okay, then you're gonna want to edit the sprite. Now you're gonna want to not make like another thing. You're just gonna want to keep it this way. But this time you're gonna want to make the actual door on this. So you know. Oh, wait, hold on. I gotta click this one. All right, there we go. And like a little bit diagonally. And then there we go. And then we put in some black. All right, we got that. So now we're gonna, um, let's see. Oh yeah, we're gonna duplicate it. And we're gonna call it S light. Oh yeah, by the way, you're gonna wanna put no after it because it's the left side. Same thing with darkness. Okay, you gotta make sure this is recording. Yep. All right, <clears throat> so right here, you're gonna want to, um, let's see. You're gonna want to, oh yeah, I might mess up the outline. Darn it. Uh, let's see. Paste. Yikes. I think I messed up a little. Wait, hold on a second. I gotta figure this out. Let's see. And I'll just fix it. Alright. Duplicate S Y T L. Alright. And you're just gonna wanna, since I messed up a little bit, you're gonna wanna, um, Put some, uh, let's see, like a dark, like a gray. No, that's the color of the room. Darn it. Like that kind of color. Be good, I think. Yeah, that's good. Alright, you're gonna wanna do that and then just fill it in. Oh, wait, how do you, oh yeah, there you go. Okay, we got that and we're gonna add like a little like light bulb at the top. So let's try that if we can. Do -do -do. No, that looks really bad. 
Let's see. I'm sorry if my art skills are really bad. <laughs> okay. Then we just boop, boop, boop. All right. Now that we have that, um, we're gonna we're gonna uh, all right. Oh yeah, we're gonna do the same thing with the other side. So let's get some of this. Copy. Then make a sprite s dark this. And then put an R for the right side. Now this time I'm not gonna mess up, so all you're gonna have to do is do like an outline. Good. All right, there you go. Then that way. There we go. Okay. Then you're gonna wanna duplicate it. S Y, right? Then you're gonna want to do the exact same thing like we did with the other one. Fill it in. See, it looks better that way. It's because on the other one I messed up a little. So it might look a little weird. All right, yellow for the light bulb. Oh gosh. There we go, and then some lines. My art skills are really bad whenever I'm not really trying, but it's all right. It's just a tutorial. All right, so we got that now, and we're gonna, let's see, what do we need now? Oh yeah, we're gonna make the, um. oh wait, let's uh, put, it, put them in the room first though. So let's see, game, create an object, oh, darkness, left. Then you're gonna pick the sprite. There you go. Then you're gonna want to make another one with the other sprite. Oh, darkness, right. I'm sorry if this episode is gonna be a little short, cause I'm kind of in a hurry. Okay, let's get black. There we go. We are gonna make the light function, so don't worry. All right, room office, the right one, let's see. We're gonna have to fit, oh yeah, by the way, you're gonna have to put the snap at like one. And then let's just like fit that in somehow. Let's see, like that. Don't mind the um, white line, just like that. All right. And then you're gonna want to get the other side, put that in. Let's see. Alright, you gotta find a way to fit this somehow. Let's see. Hmm. Like right there, I think would be good. Yeah, it's all right. All right, we got that. Now we're gonna want to make the exact same objects, but with the light instead. So O, light, left, and then O, light, right. No way. Hold on. Yeah, that's how you do it. Okay. Um, uh, let's see. Okay, we got that. No, wait, hold on. Don't I have to... Wait, alright, don't make an object. Sorry, I think I messed up. Messing up a lot in this video. Okay, you're gonna wanna copy that and paste it into your background office. There we go. Then you're gonna want the other side. 
and do the exact same thing. All right, there we go. And now we need, okay. So this time we're gonna, yeah, all right. We're gonna put negative two on these things. And then we're gonna want to, let's see. Oh yeah, create the objects. Wait, oh no, never mind. All right, you're gonna make negative one instead. Probably gonna want the fan like at negative 100 or something. Okay, we got that and now, let's see. All right, so it's gonna look like that and if we move that, yeah, all right. I think I got this under control now. Let's see. Let's see. All right, that looks all right. Okay, then we're gonna want to make some buttons. So let's see. We're gonna go into the background, like copy out like pretty good box, and then we're gonna start doing it. Okay, so S. Um, let's see. Light button okay paste that in then we're gonna want to make another thing and I'll see you guys in a second once I'm done Okay, so right here you're gonna want to make a red button. Oh wait, I forgot to fill in the back. Okay. Oops, I made a door button. Let me fix that. Okay, there we go. Okay, you're gonna want to duplicate that and call it S light button green, which means when it's on. I think we should make a mask mechanic. I think that would work best with this. Okay, we got those two buttons ready. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make Oh, um, we're just gonna call it button a uh, red, right, left. Okay, and then when all right, we won't make that yet. All right, we're gonna do the exact same thing. Oh, button red, right. Okay, then we're gonna want to make more, but instead with the green button. So, O, button, green, left. Then O, button, green, right. Okay, so on the left one and the right one, you're gonna want to do this. When the mouse is left pressed, it's gonna want to pick this one over here, the one like that looks like it's jumping. Pick that, 
running Ven CS, and then make it to where it changes to the green one on the left side, and that it will destroy the darkness on the left. Okay, so then on the one for the left, we're gonna want to do the exact same thing, but instead, it will change to the red button, and then let me just find the coordinates of the the darkness. Okay, let's see. Gotta find out where the line is. This might be a little bit hard. Let's see. I'll see you guys in a second when I find the um coordinates. Wait, I think I got a better idea. I'm gonna change the thing for it to be a little bit darker. see okay now I can find it all right so let's see 
All right, 32, 32, oh God, 32, somewhere around there would be good. Oh wait, hold on. Okay, we got it. Now let's test it out. It's compiling. Okay, I'm gonna just load the game so I can be quick. Why isn't it loading? Oh yeah, that was one of the problems. I'll fix that in the next episode. Just use the new game button for right now. Okay, we gotta wait. Okay, so there's a fan, it's spinning all right. Now, when you click the button, it will turn it on and off. Same with the other door. Okay, that door messed up a little. Yeah, I don't think the coordinates got put in right. I'll fix that right now. Let's see. Okay, now let's see if it works now. Okay, that one works all right. This one, oh god. Okay, let's fix, let's fix it. Okay, new game. Okay, that all works. Yeah, I'll I'll fix that. I'll fix that um off time. Okay, so that that's going to be the end of this episode of, you know, the Game Maker tutorial. If you want a part three, like the video. I am sorry that I messed up a lot because I haven't done this in a long time. But I'll see you guys in the next video. And let's roll out the outro.